Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're going to use the structuring assignment to assign variables from objects. The structuring allows you to assign a new variable name when extracting values. You can do this by putting the new name after a colon when assigning the value using the same object from the last example. Constant user is equal to name and age. Here you can give new variables names in the assignment. So the constant new username age user age is equal to user. Okay, and you may read it as get the value of user.name and assign it to a new variable named username, and so on. Replace two, the two assignments with an equivalent destructuring assignment. It should still assign the variables hi today and hi tomorrow, the values of today and tomorrow from the high underscore temperature object. So again, with this one, I'm not really understanding it entirely. I'm just going to, I mean, obviously we're gonna wanna, we're gonna wanna set a constant and then our variables are going to be yesterday. Yesterday. And we wanna set the values of today and tomorrow. Assign the value, the variables high today and high tomorrow. Uh, what? High temperatures is equal to yesterday, to today, and tomorrow. I want to set the variables of high of high today. Today. Yeah, we want to set today to be high today, and then high tomorrow. It's going to be high tomorrow. And we want to set this equal to high temperatures. Interesting. Then we don't want these guys in here. I'm just going to comment them out for now. Just like with the last one, we've got reference errors, but it might be right. High today, high tomorrow. You should remove ES5 syntax. Okay, so it doesn't want it in there. Run the tests. That passes. Okay, I'm not going to lie, I'm not really understanding this one. Hi today, hi tomorrow. Hi today should be 77. But the console's not reading it out, so... 77 and 80. This should be not defined, but it's not not defined, it's actually a reference error, because yesterday is not defined. Maybe if we went... Maybe if we set, like, yeah, yesterday. With that, that would give us a value. Then it would just, yeah, and then so high temperatures would be now would have shifted. No, it's just pulling out the values and assigning it to different variables. So I guess that's the idea is that you can access variables this way. Um, so yeah, that's it. Uh, this is a weird one. I don't quite understand why we're doing that, but I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this and we'll see you in the next one.